Hey y'all, what's pop, lock, and dropping? It's your girl, Melaja Tore. Welcome back to my channel. So today I have y'all a hair install video. So I'm not big on wearing wigs. I am an extension girly. So I teamed up with this amazing business, Grand Hair Palace. They sent me three beautiful bundles, 20A, 26, and a 24 inch. And they also sent me some lashes. So if you wanna see See how this look came together. Keep on watching. And I bow like the Barbie. I'm a dog, but I still wanna party. Pink felt like I'm ready to bend. I'm a ten, so I pull in a can. Like Jazzy, Stacy, Ricky. All of the Barbies is pretty. Damn, all of the Barbies is bad. It girls, and we ain't playing tag. What's poppin'? It's your girl, Malaysia, checking in with you. Well, what's pop lock and dropping, actually? So today I'm gonna do a hair install and I'm gonna show y'all how I install my bundles. I usually get a sew-in, but where I used to get my hair done, I don't go there anymore. Oh, sorry, let me mute my phone. I do not go there anymore and I will not be going there anymore because I go there all the time. I spend good money, I tip good, I bring them wine, you know what I mean? I'm a great customer. I have manners, I don't speak, I mind my business, get my hair done, and I go. And this past time that I was there, I guess they got new management, and the new manager, you know, she's this African lady who's so rude. The African lady that owned the shop before was very nice, I loved her, she treated me like, you know, a good paying client. This new African lady that was there, ill, 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 ill. Ew. you don't walk up to people and talk to people like that I don't care how you talk to your family and the people that you associate yourself with when you walk up to somebody that you do not know you come at them with manners and with respect and if you don't well then you're just gonna lose clientele and just go ahead and whatever so the new manager had an attitude with me and I was just like uh I walked right out because I've changed my ways I used to have a horrible attitude I'm talking about I used to turn up on people when they would be disrespectful towards me but I'm getting older, my man is gorgeous, and I can't be acting like that no more because I have a lot to lose now. And your attitude towards things can literally make or break you in life. Like you could have an attitude one time and you will get cut right then and there. So watch your attitude and I'll watch my attitude. But even though somebody could have a bad attitude towards me, I'm still learning how to check my attitude and not let it get to me. So, but at the end of the day, I don't need them anymore um, my hair is finally grown out to where I can start doing my glue-ins again so I like to do a glue-in mainly because I don't like it when my head starts itching when my head starts itching too much and I gotta pat it and I can't get up in there it's just really 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 annoying so I was like you know what and then wigs I don't like wigs because I am a perfectionist excuse my hair you know it's like all over the place I didn't put any curl cream or anything in it um but I'm a perfectionist so I'm not gonna lie I don't really know how to just lay my lace like that I could lay a lace but it might lift up like within an hour so I'm just not a lace expert so I don't do wigs I'm cool on the sew-ins for now my hair is good enough to do a glue-in and so I'm back to doing my glue-ins and I personally really love glue-ins you can go in there and oil your, oil your scalp whenever you want to you can style your hair however you want to and not even just that you're more than likely to take better care of your bundles because you know your hair is mixed in with the extensions and so instead of just frying you know your hair extensions you're taking care of your extensions just like you would your hair because it is mixed together and so my ear extensions will last you a lot longer if you know how to take care of your extensions so I've already washed my hair. You wanna start off with a clean scalp, obviously. Make sure you moisturize your scalp, condition your scalp, and wash your hair. You don't wanna go in with greasy, oily hair. You want your hair to blend well with your extensions. And me, I got, thankfully, all textures of hair are good hair. You know, just because you have straight hair, wavy hair, or whatever, curly hair, doesn't mean that you have 
better hair than anybody you know all if your hair is growing and you got a couple inches you got good hair but you know me i have a very um i wouldn't say fine but my hair is like a chameleon it honestly will blend in with any kind of extensions that i have i have very manageable hair so it doesn't get frizzy it doesn't start like acting crazy like my hair blends in really well with my extensions always so that's also why i can do a glue in now if you have really curly hair really coarse hair i would not recommend getting a glue in unless you can find you extensions that will match your natural hair texture and thankfully you know i don't have too much of an issue with that but i did already put some black dye on these because i want them to blend in with my hair and I've already washed them and conditioned them. So I'm going to blow dry these real quick and just show you how I install them. All right, y'all, so let's get into this install. So you're gonna only need seven items in order to make your install look nice and flawless. The first thing you're gonna need is a pick comb. This is so whenever you're dividing your hair, it's straight. That way your bundles will be laid flat. And then you're gonna need some scissors obviously to cut your wefts i know a lot of girls don't like to cut their bundles but personally it's just hair and i'm doing a glue in so i need to cut my bundles and then a brush for obvious reasons and then you're going to need your glue they have two different kinds of hair bonding glue i like this one i always get the big one because girl i do glue ins all the time and they also has a they also have a glue remover it looks just like this except for it's clear and whenever you take out your glue and extensions what you'll do is you'll get that glue remover put it right on the weft of your bundles let it soak in get some shampoo and conditioner and just scrub them out and they will fall right out it literally will not pull your hair out the only way that the glue will pull your hair out is if you do not do the glue remover and shampoo and condition your hair conditioner and the glue remover are your best friends when it comes to removing your extensions and then next you're going to need a straightener i'm going to straighten my hair first before i start uh, well no, i'm not going to straighten my whole head first as i'm installing the hair i'm going to be straightening my hair that way my hair blends in with the extensions and then you're going to need a blow dryer the blow dryer is your best friend when it comes to the glue and i say that because the blow dryer is going to seal your weft and dry the glue it's almost like i don't know how else to say it girl it's just gonna seal the deal your extensions are not going to come out and then lastly you're gonna need a back mirror this is also your best friend that way you can see your head and see where you're laying down your extensions and there we go now i'm not gonna do too much talking i'm just gonna do this and probably do a little bit of a voiceover because there's not really much to explain you're just gonna part your hair where you feel like you want your extensions at i'm gonna start very low because obviously my hair is short right here so i want the extensions to start right here that way it covers up this length of my hair and honestly it's just it's self-explanatory girl just part Put the extensions in, blow dry and glue it, and then make sure you have your part how you want it first. So I always would move my hair to this side, which is why my hair naturally just goes to the left more, like, more easy or easier, whatever, <laughs> easily. <laughs> um, but lately, I've been liking my part on this side. I don't know why for some reason. It just, like, I've been liking my part on this side, like... It just is giving like I never even thought I would like it on this side because this is my good side honestly because um, this is where my mole is at and I just feel like it's just like my best side I feel like this is my mom and this is my dad's side you see the difference isn't it crazy how like two sides of your face could be so different it's like cousin twin cousin twin <laughs> like I don't get it but you know again my mole also throws my symmetrics off but yeah, girl, let's get into this install. I'm excited. They sent me three, excuse my hair, Ugh, looks crazy, I know. They sent me three bundles. I'm thinking that this length right here is, and they sent three different lengths. I personally, I like all my, I recommend, honestly, don't get layered bundles because your bundles are going to shrivel up regardless. And if your bundles are going to shrivel up, you want your bundles to shrivel up evenly. They sent me three different links, which is okay. I didn't you know, tell them what I like or anything like that. 
Um, I could just, you know, cut this off to make it even. It would just be like literally two inches of hair. But um, I'm going to just go ahead and install it this way and just leave it and not cut it so I can see how it looks. Because I just personally don't like my bundles and layers because it's just, it's pointless. Like you should get all of your bundles the same length. That way when they start to sh um, shed, they shed evenly instead of, you know, one bundles all the way up here, one bundles down here, one bundles down here. It's just, it's pointless. So yeah. And I believe that they sent me this they sent me really long like i'm not gonna lie i'm really pleased like look this reaches all the way down to here so i'm assuming that they sent me 26 28 no this isn't a 30. i think this is actually 26. yeah because 28 would reach right in the middle of my butt so i believe that they sent me 26 24 22 or this is probably 28 26 24 because this could be a 28 or a 26 bundle right here because it reaches all the way down to right here so this is probably a 28 so it's probably 28 26 and then 24 because this one is also very long and i'm really glad that they sent me long bundles like thank y'all so much grand hair palace i really appreciate it because i don't like wigs and i'm glad i like it when companies reach out to me but they study me first you know, they look at my profile, they look at my Instagram, they look at my YouTube, they look at my style, they see what I like versus people just sending me stuff that, that does not correlate with the person that I am at all. So I really appreciate Grand Hair Palace for looking at my profile first before just sending me any type of hair. And yeah, because this is perfect. And I have extensions still, you know, my hair that I usually use is really good still, but it's always nice to have some fresh bundles. And yeah, girl, and they smell good. I just washed them. I put a black rinse on there, but it doesn't seem like it took that well, which is okay, because I don't think my hair is too jet black. I think it'll blend perfectly, honestly. I just really, really love, like if you have dark brown hair and you throw on a black dye, it just, it's a complete difference. I love jet black hair, it's so pretty. But yeah, girl, let's go ahead and install these bundles. <laughs> Get away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. They don't 
came out ladies i freaking love it like this is actually really good hair mm. let's get the back really really pretty freaking love it look at this hair though i love it it came out really good it blends in really nicely with my hair big shout out to grand hair palace thank you so much for these bundles and if y'all want hair like this i'm gonna leave the discount code down below also with the product link so you can Get this here i believe this is now that i have it in i know that it is 28 26 and 24 inches girl i might not ever go back to 40 inches because i feel like this is a more classy length it looks really good it's manageable it's not all getting caught in my butt crack I hope y'all enjoyed this install video. If you like the way the look came out, go to grandhairpalace.com and check out their bundle deals. They also have some really cute lashes. I'll include a discount code in the description box and let them know that Malaysia sent you. Hey y'all, it's your girl Malaysia. Thank you so much for watching my channel. Don't forget to subscribe so you can be one of the first to be notified when I drop a new vlog. Don't forget, scared feet don't eat and a closed mouth won't get fed.